We don't do many unboxing videos here on the Pocketlint channel because mostly they're all the same and there's nothing new or interesting to show. But when I was offered the chance to check out the new special edition ROG Phone 6, I just couldn't help myself. I'm Cam Bunton and this is our unboxing and hands-on look at the special Diablo Immortal edition of the ROG Phone 6. And boy, is it something else. If you do like this video, please do leave a thumbs up, subscribe and tap the notification bell to make sure you don't miss any more. Now let's start with the outer packaging or carton. It's a little different to the usual. In fact, it's not little, it's massive and designed to look like the in-game Haradric cube that transforms items that you place inside it. Except this one has some Diablo artwork with lots of fine detail. It's pretty impressive. Now I could look at it for a long time, but let's dive into the goodies inside instead. There are a few items here and first up is this fake leather pouch. It's designed to look like an aged leather scroll with a map printed on the outside. It's a lovely detail you just don't get with regular edition phones. It has a function too because inside once you've unfilled it you get access to the charging accessories. And that means the 65 watt wire charger with a type C port and that can refill the 6000 milliamp hour battery in about 40 minutes. Sadly it's not themed like the packaging in the phone and neither is the nylon weave coated USB-C charging cable that sits in the other pocket. Now the map is hiding some other secrets too but in order to see those you have to unpackage the small little UV torch that's in the little box inside the packaging. And when you switch that on after putting in a battery it highlights hidden markings in the map that you can't see clearly without it. Of course for maximum effect you need to switch the lights off. Those markings include this web link which is qr.asus.com forward slash Diablo which if you go to it, it takes you to a registration site where you can register your phone and claim in-game rewards in Diablo Immortal. But let's get to the other box that the phone lives in. Because this one is designed to look like the world stone from the game. And if you slide it open upwards, you'll see the phone standing up inside it, which will move to one side as we dive into the rest. That includes this neat little box nestled in the rear of it, which when open revealed this Diablo themed gold sim ejector tool. Inside the cardboard stand you'll find the ROG phone's bumper case which, like nearly everything else, is themed. And again if we whip out the UV torch we'll find some more hidden red accents in the markings on the back of the case. Ok so finally let's get to the actual phone. And the Diablo theming starts as soon as you open it up and power it on. The back of the phone features that same graphic from the outer packaging that we saw earlier and even the first setup screen has this terrifying devil figure animated on it before you've even set up the phone. Most of the external detailing is on the back of the phone and features that figure that we've already seen plus a finish called Hellfire Red which when you angle it towards the light correctly gives you this moving shimmering flame effect. There are of course RGB elements on the phone, the Diablo Immortal and ROG logos light up on the back as does the smaller Diablo Immortal logo near the side. There are further markings on the camera protrusion as well as immortality weights printed on it. It features three cameras with a primary 15 megapixel snapper alongside the 13 megapixel ultrawide and a 5 megapixel macro. Other than that it's the same as any other ROG Phone 6. It has the red accented SIM tray on the edge and two USB-C ports, one on the bottom and the other on the side, designed for clipping on the optional Aero Active Cooler. It is a gaming phone so you do get a 3.5mm headphone port in the bottom as well as two powerful stereo speakers and those sit on either side of the 6.78 inch AMOLED display. It's a fantastic screen too, offering up to 165Hz refresh rates for super slick gaming graphics and up to 1200 nits peak brightness and support for HDR10 Plus and 1 billion colours. It's the same panel we've seen already on the ROG Phone 6 and the ROG Phone 60 Ultimate and in our testing it's been fantastic for media watching and gaming. Now if you want to see our ROG Phone 60 Ultimate review you can find it by clicking on that link up there or if you want to read our ROG Phone 6 review you can click it in the description box down below. Other details include the Snapdragon 8 Plus Gen 1 processor for fast, smooth and efficient performance and the fact that it's available to order in limited numbers right now direct from ASUS. It costs £1,099 in the UK or $1,299 in the US. So there you go, let me know what you think of this special Diablo Immortal Edition phone. Use the comments down below or you can get me on Twitter, I'm at Cam Bunton. I'm also using that same handle on Mastodon. If you did like it, please do leave a thumbs up, subscribe and tap the notification bell and I'll see you again in the next one. Bye for now.